So welcome at uh, part two of this tutorial. So today we are gonna make the basic script, the base script. So let's go and select the cube. Go to at component new script C sharp and this will be named movement create an ad okay so let's edit it here we are going to make a few few game objects and objects so it will be a private vector free offset then will be a public game object player public game object center then we are gonna have four in other public game objects we are gonna name them up down left and right the another thing that we are gonna uh, change here we are gonna make a public int that will be named step we'll set it defaultly to 9 let's go and we will have a public float speed that will equal to float 0 0.01 now we are gonna add a boolean input that we are gonna use later so at the start we are not gonna write anything firstly we will make four another methods of type an i enumerator i enumerator move up player dot transform position sorry center so center dot transform dot position equals to player dot transform dot position we are gonna make a for loop here we are gonna uh, set int equals to zero int i equals to zero till i is less than 90 
slash divided by step I plus plus take this into the for loop and add another line yield this is gonna make the pause return new wait for seconds speed of a value of the speed uh, I'm sorry this this goes this goes here and here we are gonna add player dot transform dot rotate around up dot transform dot position vector of a vector free dot right oh tight <laughs> right and by a step which we are gonna set here how much is it gonna be so let's let's make more of these actually four that move down move left and move right right okay here we are gonna change the just this to back this to forward and this to left now in the update so if input equals to equals to true then we will set if input dot get key get key uh, input dot get key key code da up arrow arrow so the input will be set to false oh for but firstly we are gonna start coroutine move up okay so now duplicate duplicate this if four times so here will be uh, the left arrow here will be the down arrow and here will be the right arrow move right move left move down move down so now change these game objects in the script 
to when down to down when move left then left the, uh, we are assigning the empties and right right okay another thing that we are gonna uh, add here is that input at the, at, the, at the end of the methods the input will equal to true but during but during the, uh, when when the coroutine starts the input is false so when it finishes it sets inputs to true input so also give it also here here and here so that should be it for for the coding so just save it and now movement so now he under our script movement <laughs> I made a mistake we uh, you should see these unassigned objects so we can uh, say what our step will be and what our speed will be and here we have to assign these objects so so right is gonna be right up is gonna be up left is gonna be left and down is gonna be down center center and a player player will be the cube the player and the cube is going oh okay bye